So you know you want to know how to answer that question. Tell me about a time you dealt with a difficult person. So in this video, I'm going to walk through an example of exactly how to do that. And I'm going to be using myself as the example. So stay tuned. Okay. I want to tell you a story about this. So there was a time in my career where I was the difficult person and I had someone handle it really, really well. And I'm going to offer you that example today. After chatting with this person, I found it very difficult not to cooperate with her. And I want to share how she handled it because I don't think you can go wrong with this approach. The situation was that I was withholding information. I wasn't helping her out. The, this was a new girl and her name was Laura. She was really nice. And honestly, I was a bit jealous of her. I thought that she was prettier than me. And I was honestly just feeling jealous and I was purposely not acting very very well and I was withholding information from her. So it's not something that I'm proud of, but at the time that was a long time ago and I think the story could really help. So how did Laura handle this? So the first thing she did was she asked me if I'd like to go for coffee with her. She wanted to take me to one of her favorite coffee shops where we could chat. So at first I didn't really want to, but I felt like if I didn't, she was going to continue to ask and I eventually was going to have to. So I didn't really want to go, but I agreed to go because it was the right thing to do. What happened was we went for coffee and she said to me the following thing. She said, I know I'm new here and that you don't know me very well yet, but I would like to help as much as I can. She said, I'm happy to do whatever it is that you need for us to make our working relationship smoother for both of us. And if there's something that I did that bothered you, please let me know because I'm kind of feeling like you don't like me very much. And she left it at that. So me as the difficult person didn't really know how to reply to that. I was kind of thinking, oh, well, poor girl, she actually wants to do her best and I'm getting in her way. So this was difficult for me to react in any other way then favorably. And I said, no, I'm sorry. It has nothing to do with you. I'm having a hard time. So then she just talked. We didn't talk about work anymore. She just talked about the things that she liked to do and invited me to go to yoga with her. She's like, you know, I've been under a lot of stress too. And something that really helps me is yoga. And I did not want to go to yoga with her. So I declined her offer, but I did think it was nice of her to ask. What happened in the end was that I softened up. I started to work better with her. We started to have a better working relationship. And to this day, even though we don't work at the same company, we still talk and we still help each other out. That's what can happen when you deal with a difficult person effectively. And I know because I was the difficult person. So as long as the person is being genuine, then it is the best way to go. So let me ask you, have you ever been a difficult person before? And if so, how have people handled you? Has someone else been able to get you to go from a tough spot to change your perspective? If so, I'd love to hear about it. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. I also have a free guide. It's chock full of example answers, just like the one in this video. You can download it below and you can start writing your perfect answers for your next interview so you can walk in completely confidently. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.